Hello everyone and welcome back to Genie Crafts. I'm back with another paper cut portrait video but this time we are going to do it a little differently. We are going to make a layered portrait of the god of Indian cinema Rajinikanth. For creating a layered portrait you will need a SVG template. An SVG template is nothing but an image consisting of layers of colors. The more number of layers the more realistic your portrait will look but normally it is better to keep these number of layers between 5 and 8. And you can define the total number of layers you want when you are creating your SVG template. For this tutorial we have kept the number of layers to 5. So the layers of craft papers would be like, we'll start with the black layer, then we have the shade of green, then after that peacock blue shade, then brown and then the light brown color. Just ensure that all the papers that you are using for this portrait are thick and you are using at the minimum 220 to 270 GSM paper because thicker the paper the better layered effect you get when you complete your portrait. For each layer you should have a colored printout handy. So for this portrait ideally you should have 5 colored printouts and you will use each printout for each of the layers. So start with the base layer, stick your template on the colored paper and cut out the shape along the borders for the base layer. Once cut, keep this layer aside as you will use this layer for sticking rest of the layers on top of it. Now the first layer is the easiest layer because you just need to cut along the borders. The problem starts with the second layer and onwards. So whenever you are cutting any layer, just ensure that you are removing all the colors on your printout prior to that layer. So if I am working on the peacock blue layer, I will remove the colors of green and black from my template. If I am working on the green layer then I will remove the colors of black because these are the colors that are in prior sequence. Now it's time to stick this layer onto the previous layer. So for that you can use glue stick, transparent glue or fevicol. Just ensure that you have applied glue on sufficient places so that this layer remains stuck to the previous layer. Once you are done with the major part of that layer, there will be some isolated pieces here and there for that particular color which you will need to also stick onto the previous layer. So cut them out separately and using the cutout portion as a reference point, paste those smaller pieces also. Second layer is the most critical layer for any layered art or layered portrait because it sets the tone of alignment for rest of your portrait. So give it sufficient time and do not hurry when you are working on the second layer. Now we will move on to the third layer which is the peacock blue layer. So when you are cutting portions out for this layer you need to remove the green color and the black color because these are the two layers prior to the peacock blue. I am using the leftover portion from the previous layer but ideally you should use a fresh printout. I only had one printout so I am making do with what I had. Now we are working on the last layer. The last layer will have the most disconnected parts. 
so ensure that you do not miss out any part because every single small piece of paper makes a difference on the final look of the portrait check carefully that you have covered all the parts on your template and stick them to their correct places and this is how our portrait is going to look like after all five layers are finished this looks really beautiful i have made this once before also but this time i had better colors to choose with and i had thicker paper also so ensure that you are aligning the parts cor correctly and also ensure that you are using a thick paper for a good look of a layered portrait I hope you guys found this video useful. In my next video, I will be showing how to create these layer templates using online utilities. If you guys like this video, then please do not forget to hit the like, share and subscribe button. I will see you guys very soon in my next video. Till then, take care, stay safe and bye-bye.